Guys, it's Selena and today I'm going to be doing a nice collective try on haul of items from Black Friday, Christmas, and post Christmas. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I do have a lot of things to show you, so we're gonna get right into the video. So the first store that I shopped at on Black Friday online was H&M. It is one of my favorite stores and I always go there first because they have very affordable items. And so the first thing that I got was this black crew neck sweatshirt. It was $12.59 and the original price was $17.99. I really like it because it's very oversized, very comfortable. The only thing that I don't like about it is for some reason in the picture, I didn't see that it was like a high low cut I never buy from the girls section so I really didn't pay attention but I would have preferred for it to be like round if that makes sense so but I do like it a lot it's very comfortable and very warm so the next thing that I got is this army green hoodie which still has a tag on it because I haven't worn it yet but I really really like this it's a very nice neutral color and it also has like pockets on the sleeves I don't I think they do open but this costed $13.99 the original price was $19.99 so this is a more lightweight sweater that I was thinking of wearing like under a jean jacket or something but I haven't worn it yet the next thing was this plain black cardigan I wear a lot of cardigans to church in the winter time and I have almost every color of the rainbow except for black can you believe that so I ended up getting another one I have one that's just like this in red like maroon ish and so I really like the fit of this it's also very comfortable very warm and the original price was $17.99 and I paid $12.59 for it so I really really like this very nice casual you know well, the last thing that I got from H&M, I'm not going to try this one on because it actually doesn't fit, but I am going to show it anyways. I got this white cardigan which cost $6.29. The original price was $12.99. So it was basically 50% off and I got it in a size extra small. Listen, the other cardigan was extra small and it fit just fine, but this one does not fit. I also don't like it because it's too transparent. It's a little bit too small. I don't know what happened. I took the tag off before I like tried it on because I assumed it was going to fit. So I can't even return it. So the next store I'm going to be showing you guys is Hollister. I only got one item from here which was this pair of high waisted gray joggers. These are a size extra small. Hollister is my hands down favorite brand for sweatpants and joggers. Super comfortable, super soft. They literally match so well with everything. And they're also like a little bit cinched at the end, but I really like the way that they fit me. I don't have a pair of joggers that fits me the way that these fit me, but I really, really like them. So the original price for these was $39.95 and I got them for $19.97. Hollister, before I move on, is kind of a scam. You need to wait for these to be on sale. I have four pairs of sweatpants and joggers from Hollister and I had to wait for them to be on sale because $39.95 these are not worth $39.95, so if you can pay $19, you pay $19, but you wait patiently for these to go on sale, which is what I did. The next store that I shopped at was Abercrombie, or Abercrombie, however you pronounce it. I only got one item from here as well. I don't really like that store very much. Like, I buy a few items, like one or two items from there every now and then, but I did hop on there because I wanted this beanie for a very long time, but it was $20, and I was like... I'm not paying $20 for this plain black beanie that says Abercrombie and Fitch on the front. We're not doing that. So I waited patiently for it to be on sale and I got it for $10 on Black Friday. I'll put it on really quick so you guys can see it, but it's really cute. I've worn it a few times to work and it fits over my box braids, which is my favorite thing ever. So this is the beanie. So now we're going to move on to Christmas. Since I'm getting older, I am no longer getting a lot of huge extravagant presents. So I only got like, I think two items from my mom. My mom is very sweet and I was complaining about not having a large enough winter jacket. So she went and she purchased me another North Face jacket. This is like winter approved i love it so much it's very big very warm it has like i don't even know what this texture is called on the inside but i like 
it's really nice so this is actually from the girl section so it's a size extra large because she said that they didn't have any with a hood that's also very important for me because I live in New Jersey it rains a lot and it snows a lot so I wanted to make sure that I got a jacket with a hood and she said they only had jackets that were hooded in the girl section and not in the adult section so it's an extra large in basically kids but it fits me like perfect she also got me this nice facial scrubber from essentially high toast which is Ooh, my favorite thing that I got by far I've been using this every single day so it's like a little wireless it comes with this um, thing and a charger and so I've been using it every single day twice a day and I've been seeing the craziest changes in my skin so if you don't have one I definitely recommend this is also um, more affordable than the brand what is the name of the brand that everyone is buying where they sell like the Fofo and the Luna Foreo? Foreo. So the Foreo ones are usually like between $80 and $100, up to $250 actually. And this one on the essentially, um, this one on the essentially high dose or hey dose website was only I think $35 if I'm not mistaken. So I definitely recommend they also have a lot of different colors, but these are very, very good for your skin. The last thing that I'm going to be showing you guys from Christmas was actually from my best friend Marcus. I was telling him for a very long time that I wanted the coconut collection and he got me two items from there. So this palette is a really nice neutral palette if you haven't seen it before. I love the color so much and it's my first neutral palette as well. And then he also got me these um, lip tint, lip crayons that they like tint your lips. I don't have both of them right now because they're both in my purse but... So the last thing that I'm going to be showing you guys are from post Christmas. So my mom, she did give me a gift card in addition to the jacket and the little face cleansing brush. And so I used the gift card to buy a few things online. So the first thing that I got was this Adidas Windbreaker from PacSun. I'm like completely in love with this. The original price was $80 and I got it for $40, which it was just a complete steal. It's also a small from the men's section, but it fits me perfectly fine. It has a hood, which you can actually like zipper up i took it out because i like the hood but i actually don't know how to put it back inside the rest of the items that i got were basically just like skincare products and makeup so i got the pretty fresh collection from ColourPop. i've been wanting this for a very long time so i got the tin and moisturizer in the color medium 12w and the creamy concealer in the color medium 90w so so far i really like this collection i actually have it on my face right now just the tinted moisturizer i like it i like it a lot my face actually like looks fresh all throughout the day i don't look as oily and it lasts all day the only thing that i don't like about it is when i put it on it looks ashy for some reason like now it looks like the right color but in the morning when i put it on it looks a little bit ashy a little bit white but throughout the day it oxidizes a lot so now it's like the right color for the most part but that's the only thing that i don't like but the collection for the most part has been a success for me so the last items that i got were again from the same website that i got the facial cleansing brush from essentially hey toes hi toes <laughs> um i got two masks from there i got the mini masks which were actually only eight dollars because it was like a christmas sale so I got these both for $8. I got the Bright and Tight, Bright, Tight, and Smooth Honey Mask and the Hello Sunshine Antioxidant Clay Mask. And I also got the little brush for like $2 as well at the end of the year sale, which was like 30% off the whole store. So, so far, I can only speak highly of these two masks. I've been using this blue one for about two to three days in a row. And all the little bumps that I had on my cheeks and on my jawline, they all have gone away. Like, I've had such a good experience with these two masks. And I've also had the same experience with the yellow one for the most part. It's been balancing my face, toning it, like amazing so 10 out of 10 recommend this brand their products are all completely organic as well so for somebody that has sensitive skin like me these products that are organic and no fragrance and none of that extra stuff that messes with your skin has been amazing for my skin i'm gonna leave their site linked below they're gonna have a lot of new things coming out this year and i hope to become a brand ambassador for this year as well thank you guys for watching this video if you enjoyed it please make sure to give it a thumbs up comment down below what's next and subscribe to my channel the subscribe button is down below along with all of my social media my Instagram, my Twitter, my Spotify playlist, and I will see you guys next week.